Hello, I'm just downtown and I just missed the bus. So, that's fun. I just got this Kenko coffee. It's new, I've never seen it before. Ice brew. I might do a taste test because I don't know what else I'm gonna do while I'm downtown right now. I already went to the toilet. Yeah, I already went to the toilet. I already ate my banana, ate a nectarine. And now just trying to make it look like I'm not actually talking to myself in public. So that's fun. So let's just taste my coffee, I suppose. I'm about trying to vlog in... Oh, look at that car. Trying to vlog in public with one hand or two hands is so hard. <sighs> Ew, what is that? Oh. It says with a hint of coconut flavor. I don't like coconuts. Ew. <sighs> oh, that's not nice. <laughs> Ew, I'm still gonna drink it though. Hello, interruption time. I actually popped into Penny's on the way before I went into Eason's because I wanted to pick up something small for Melanie. It was like a little thank you gift. So I got her a little selection packet of face masks. I got her a light blue nail polish to match her suit because when I was on the bus on the way up she uploaded a picture of the suit she was wearing so I was like it'd be so cute if I got her nail polish matching that colour so then every time she wears it she can think back to her book signing and like good times and then also I wrote a little letter just saying how cute and amazing she is so yeah that explains the next few steps back to the video <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hi. I just thought it was all my family are like either dead or gone. Yeah, Jesse <laughs> over there. Like, just like heads floating. Um, so oh, you too. Yeah, I'm right. Yeah. Yeah. This um, name I got like Twitter probably. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, because yeah, some stuff. Like, <laughs> so I was like, oh my god, how are you? Yeah. Oh no, thank I you, you so much. And I got you a nail polish to match your suit because I seen it on Twitter. You like, are actually adorable. You're so <laughs> nice. Thanks, I'm very welcome. I love presents. <laughs> That's so nice. Um, and do you? You're from town. Yeah, you're, you're from close enough. Originally from Florida. I live in Florida. Oh, do you? Yeah. Yeah. John used to live in Melbourne like, for years and years. I went to secondary school in um, the Loretto there. Um, <laughs> did you? Oh my god. <laughs> I, I had a bad experience in that lane where I, I, I can't, I get like, I'm so anxious if I go into Melbourne now. Like a cloud forms over my head. Just like <laughs> some bad times. And also, you know, like, exes and stuff like that. Oh just reminds me of a lot of bad times. <laughs> I, I spelled my name wrong, didn't I? Because in some people's books I'm writing like Malumilu. Because I don't have, I'm going to have to get a, a signature just so like people can, you know, if two people who I signed their books and went like that, they'd be like, that's not a real signature. Look, it's not different from my one. So I need to get a signature. Thank you so much for coming as well. I'm actually vlogging it right now. I Do you have a channel? Oh yeah. God. What's it called? Your yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, right. Oh my god. I just want to ask you one question. If you had any like, advice to give like, a small YouTuber, what would be that? Advice to give a small YouTuber? Right. I, I would. Okay. Shall, shall I tell them? Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I, I think the most important thing when I was starting anyway is finding a balance between well first of all it took me a few years to figure out how to be myself on mm -hmm. on because my all my first videos yeah. i was like mimicking everyone i was watching i'm but, so struggling <laughs> oh no it will take yeah. a while but i think having a balance of making content that's searchable but also content then that you just really want to make that's for your specific subscribers mm -hmm. because if you don't make stuff that's searchable people won't find you you know yeah. like like you know how to something or just it, like broad topics like say you're reviewing a film or stuff mm. that people will be looking up and then having a balance of that of like you know 
vlog where I went horse riding, you know, like whatever it is, because I know people who've made their content so specific to their life that people can't find it. So I think like, yeah, because if you're trying to build a community anyway, that's the main thing. And then otherwise it's just, yeah, it's like that whole bullshit be yourself advice, which mm -hmm. like it takes, that takes practice and yeah. um, it takes time. And, you know, me being myself is swearing a lot and, you know, talking about certain things that like, that's why we love you, you know, I know, no, but that's it. Like, I'm kind of just like, well, well you know, it, it, some people don't appreciate it, but then like most of my audience do. So I'm just kind of like, yeah. ignore those people. Yeah, <laughs> you guys yeah. want to get in for a full show? Of course. Oh. Yes. Oh, no, you're not! I'm, I'm like a, a <laughs> giraffe today. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, oh thank you so much. I can't send me your channel as well. Oh, yeah. I actually wrote you a little letter and I put it at the bottom of it. Oh, thank you. I didn't want to be like, hey, subscribe. Red, because I'm just like laughing the whole time. Yeah, my head. Look who this is. What the hell? Not like you're already like not subscribed to her, but I'll leave her a script. I'll leave her a link in the description. I can't even talk. I'm all like, I've never talked on a phone. I started on my iPhone 5S, yeah. like the teeny tiny one, oh. and then I upgraded to this. This is like the X or the red one. <gasps> I was like, yeah, you got to upgrade. <laughs> I give people crops for whoever can actually do it. I just say I give people crops. I give people crops because I can't. I went to Starbucks and I was going to get the mango and passion fruit, but then they were out of it. So I got the ice caramel macchiato. I'm just walking to Bosaurus now. Hopefully I can remember the way, although it is kind of signposted. So pray for me. Hopefully I don't get lost. Comment down below if you think I'll get lost. But yeah, I'll do a whole recap when I'm home and everything. Wait, can I cross here? Please don't hit me. Melanie was amazing. Jessie was amazing. Didn't need my jacket. Ooh, went to Bougeon for the first time. That was actually really fun. Okay, you... Wait, is that Bosaurus right there? I'm confused. Wait, shit, do I keep... Wait, I need my map. So I need to get my... I stopped paying attention for like two seconds while I was driving and I lost my way, but I think I'm back on the right track. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, don't watch this. I swear I'm safe. Oh, that car was very close to the path. I think I'm on the right way. I don't know. Is there signposts? Wait, I better actually cross that. Oh, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I feel like Michael McIntyre when he's like, I don't know where I'm going. People are looking at me. Where the fuck is Bosaurus? Oh, I think I see it. It's too windy though. Oh god, that's so embarrassing. The car is looking at me. Ooh, that's a nice house. House tour. Right, I think that's Bosaurus. Now I have to figure out how to cross the road. One thing I don't like about Dublin. There's like five different ways to cross the road, like five different little, uh, excuse me. Oh, that smells like my Mexican burrito. Is this even a crossway? How do I cross? I'm sweating. Do you know what? When the cars stop coming, I'll just cross. <laughs> right, no one's coming. I'm crossing. Jaywalking isn't illegal in here, is it? No, no, it's not. Don't need America. Right, no trams coming. Don't want to get hit by the Lewis. That would not be a good day. Okay, I'm back on track. Ooh, I should have been doing those hot and hot bath tours. I hope I'm be for like a Dublin person. This is my drink. Ice caramel macchiato. It's delicious. I should have got a venti. I know for next time, although it's probably good though because I have to go on a bus for an hour back to back to me. So like, I don't want to have to like either have to piss 
or get the shits on the bus because I just had Mexican for the first time and I've never had it so I'm kind of afraid of what my insides might do. Is there any Lewis is coming? Oh, I think the Lewis is the scariest part. Okay, I'm at the source. Yay. Look how frizzy my hair is off today. Wind swept. <laughs> So today I went to Dublin for Melanie Murphy, see her, yeah, for her book signing. Oh, this is her new book. It's called If Only. It's fourteen ninety nine in all Easons. You can even get it online on Amazon and all different sites. That's the word. She signed it. Look, you wrote your name on a little post-it. I wrote Leanne Riley, and then she said, "Dear Leanne, enjoy." Melanie Murphy and a heart. Love it. It's so cute. I can't wait to read it. And like the print isn't really, or the print isn't like really small. It's kind of like big, so like it's not intimidating, as she said. And I'm so excited to read it. This is her second novel. Her first like fiction novel. Her first book. I also bought this today because I wanted to oh that's my receipt. 11.20 This is her first one It's called Fully Functional Ugh. Fully Functioning Did I say that right? Or I said it wrong again <laughs> Sorry my adrenaline is like Up here right now Because today was so fun Like I can't talk But um, This one's called Fully Functioning Adult No <laughs> I can't read Fully Functioning Human Almost. Growing up in an online slash offline world. Part memoir, part life guide from a YouTuber, Melanie Murphy. Yes. I should just sign this one, Melanie Murphy. She's so nice. I was so afraid that like, because I'm not good at talking to people. So I was afraid that like, when I see, when I seen her, I'd go into like a mute, like just go in mute mode and like not be able to talk to her. But instead I was like word vomiting everywhere. I was like... I love you and Je I love you and your sister Jessie's videos. You inspire me so much. You inspired me to start making my own videos. Cause like if you and Jessie can do it, like who's not to say little Ollian won't be able to do it? And she was like, yes. Oh my god! And I, I even told her I was vlogging. She said hi to you guys. You would have seen it in the clips. I got my photo with her. I hugged her like twice, I think, or three times. Three times because I gave her a little present, as you've seen beforehand. And then what happened? And then I seen. Jessie, her sister, behind like the side bookshelf, and I was kind of like, "Hey, hey, Jessie." <laughs> and then after I was done talking to Melanie, like I was talking to her for so long that your woman was even kind of like, "Okay, hey, we have to like move along now." And I was just kind of like, "Oh," because I thought I'd go mute because like, I'm not I'm not good in social social situations. But as soon as I see her, it was just like I've known her for years. I was like, "Why is it so easy to talk to you?" It was amazing. She was giving me loads of YouTube advice. She, we were having the chats. Like I just want to like sit down and have a coffee with her and talk for her longer. Lovely, lovely. Go buy her book. It's well worth it. I haven't even read it yet, and I know it's gonna be amazing. Oh, I can't wait. I'm gonna do like a full book review <gasps> when I read both of these. Thumbnail. <laughs> um, yeah, I was talking to Jessie B then after it, and I got a little vlog fo footage of her. I'm pretty sure you probably would have seen that. And she was lovely. She looked like a flipping supermodel like what the hell they both looked fab they they look even more beautiful in person i didn't even think that was possible then i hugged her and said goodbye and then i got out and it was still so sunny out i was expecting it to be raining all day i brought my big denim jacket with me didn't even need it not complaining just a bit shocked i'm so dehydrated that's probably another reason why i'm squinting i had like no water all day i had like a few mouthfuls before i left the house and i forgot to bring a bottle of water with me and i didn't want to buy one because that's bad for the planet and i already had a starbucks cup I forgot to bring my reusable cup, so I already felt guilty, so I didn't want to have more plastic in the world. So yeah. Um, is that everything? What did I do after Boojum? Yeah, I went to Starbucks, got my caramel macchiato, then I just started slowly walking to Posaurus. And that's everything. Yeah, so that's a little recap. I think that's everything. On the way home, I just listened to music on my on my iPhone and I watched a few YouTube videos to catch up. And then I was in that boy, and now I'm home. Oh yeah, and as soon as I got in the door, it started pissing raining outside. Could today get any better? 
Today was so fun. I'm so proud that I went on my own. I'm so proud. Like, I'm so independent. Who is she? We love an independent queen. But speaking of independent queens, kind of want to drink loads of water and go watch Queer Eye because I need some Jonathan in my life. He is amazing. Oh, the quotes that he says, and even Tan, and even Anthony, and even Kimono, and even Bobby. I always forget Bobby's name. I'm like, is it Bob or Bobby or what is it? <laughs> Sorry, Bobby. So yeah, that was my little day out. Comment down below what your favourite part was, what made you laugh, and any videos you'd like to see me do in the future. If you made it this far, please give it a thumbs up, and please subscribe to my channel. It really helps me out. And until next time, peace. And you know what I haven't said in ages? Stay happy. Stay saucy. Okay, I really need to go now. Bye.